Good morning, my friends. Well, today is Monday, and yes, I feel a lot better today. I'm going to be doing the bus in a few minutes. I haven't done that in about a week. It was interesting. Yesterday, I was talking to a lady, and I can tell she's really tired of the place. But you see, I made a promise to myself, and I asked a few of my friends. If you see me looking miserable, let me know. And they were like, what? That means it's time for me to get my case reopened with BRS and start looking for a new job. But I'm not there. I still know I'm doing a good job. I also know I had contact with a customer on Saturday. So it's part of my plan to stay in the orange box because she was telling me. And I go, don't worry. She goes, I'm alone. I go, you're not alone, man. You have yourself, and that's the best friend you're going to have. You have God. You have your abilities. You're just, we don't get out of focus sometimes. We have to refocus on things. And she goes, thank you. You helped me a lot. See, her f husband had just passed away, and he took care of her. I think in a relationship, you take care of each other. You don't rely on 100% on one person or the other, because if you do that, it means you're not healthy enough to take care of yourself. Me, I can take care of myself. I may get into a few problems once in a while, but I'll figure it out. And I ask God for help. As my friend Mr. Wilson says, you know, God's been there more than you knew in your life. I go, yes, me and him, we have the same footprints in the same relationship. I know he stands by me. I stand by God. Hopefully, God will have a nice person for me down the road, so I will stand with them. But in the meanwhile, I take care of me, because me is the most important thing. My mission to let people know they're not alone. There is good things in life, because everybody talks about the bad. The good thing is you got out of bed. You can move. You can think. A lot of people can't do that. You take that lemon, you make that lemonade. Even if you hate lemonade, you drink it because it will get better. But for jobs and things in your life, if you're totally miserable, please find other jobs. Find something because your life is more important than a job. Like I was talking to my friend Robin yesterday and she's like, what's the problem? I go, they want the old Susan. The old Susan's here, but the new Susan's coming out more. And I'm trying to get them all in one spot. And it, right now it's hard. She's like, what do you mean? I go, when you start therapy or counseling, you see things differently. You can't be 100% the old way. And the new way needs time to come out and develop it. But people keep telling you, do this, do that. And you don't want to. It makes it confusing sometimes. So you have to sit down and figure out which way to go. Me, I'm working on that now. I know God's got a good plan for me. Because even on YouTube, it was talking about, a, no, it was Twitter. A guy took the bar three times, didn't pass it. Finally, he did. Now he's a family lawyer for people with problems. And he goes, that was my destiny. I know it now because that was God's plan. I had a fall so I could ask for help from him to, so he could help me. So I never give up, my friends. And yes, I'm feeling better because the video's long. I hope you have a great day. Auntie Sue.